Fucking hell, that scared the shit out of me. Guess what? I hit the wrong buttons to jump again. <laughs> Fucking hell, dude. Well, that woke me up. <laughs> Still working on my coffee. So I'm a little groggy, but holy hell, that scared me. Okay, you don't need to hit R2 to climb around, Nene. God damn. This is my first time recording since the Game of Thrones finale, and it is also the one-year anniversary of Detroit Become Human, so today is a very special day. Uh, if you haven't watched the, uh, the, the special compilation video, it's like seven minutes long, not long at all, that I put up in honor of today, um, then go watch it. I'll put a card up here somewhere. So, ding, go watch it. Self-advertising. Okay. So I'm talking to this guy again. Pancration. We've heard this conversation already. Did I lie here? I didn't. Did He's I? He's a little under the water. I mean, weather. <laughs> I'm the one. I'm ready. Let's go. Time to go. Hold on one second. Any copy? Ugh. Ugh, it's very hot. The part before this, the episode before this, was the biggest, like, emotional roller coaster ever. I went from being like, oh no, I let Brasidas down! Hello there. To, what the fuck is this game? This game's hilarious. <laughs> well, come on. It is my pleasure to introduce to you Kalias, a former champion. Here in the stadium, Please, and now an esteemed Zaz here in Olympia. That's cool. My friends, it's an honor I'm for fighting. me to introduce this event, one so close to my heart, the Pancration. I will not delay you with words, for we all want to see action. For Zeus. Let the competition commence! So, I have no experience in hand-to-hand -hand fighting <laughs> in this game? I'll squish you like a bag! Oh, that's cute. That is fucking cute. How do I play this game? Ow! You fucking... Oh, God. You'll be easy. Oh! 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 <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> also, his name was Orion. I did notice that. That was your best? <clears throat> That was but the beginning! What? Now that our contestant is warmed up, let's see what she can do against... Erasto! Another scrawny guy, okay. Hello, man. Nice Good butt luck. lap. Mine's better, though. <sighs> okay, I'm gonna try and fight legit this time. Can I... I can parry, okay. Let's do this again. <laughs> Oh wow, I have quite the right hook, my goodness. Ooh, oh, oh, oh god, oh god, please roll, I can't leave the ring, got it, okay. Do I not have light attacks? No, I do. Okay, so why aren't you doing them, Cassie? Okay, that's, that's enough. Good girl, Cassandra. <laughs> Again, my webcam lighting's doing the thing again. Sorry. <laughs> I need to find a way to fix it. This is a new webcam. The crowd loves you, but you're not done yet. Not done? A fine offering to the gods, wouldn't you say? Soon, we will return to the <clears throat> final contest. The mighty Cassandra, Cassandra. against Cassandra. the reigning champion, Voria. So, I have to come back? The hell? Can we just do it now? <laughs> come on. Ugh. The fact that testicles probably couldn't stand a chance in that fight, it was that easy. It's like, oh god. Astounding! To think I could be a companion to an Olympic champion. Oh, you're even better at sparring than I am. I'm sure that's exactly what you meant. Though, if Socrates were a more willing a partner... Alcibiades! Oh my god! All right? I was with my friends, Dimophanes and Callias, respected Olympic judges, no less. Too much cheap wine? You, you look like you drank from Medea's cup. 
Medea's cup. You think he's been poisoned? Why, why would he be poisoned? You were celebrating? Uh, it's the Olympics. What's not to celebrate? We were at the Leonidaeon. Leonidaeon? Boy, that's a mouthful. If you've been poisoned, I need to find these judges. Poisoned? Do you think that they could be two or... No, never. They're good men. You can't think one of them. They host a celebration every Olympics. To celebrate the sacred truce. That's a good place to poison somebody to make a point. You stay with him. I'll find out what happened. Extend to me your olive branch. Ah! I knew there was something fishy about you, Kalias. Ah! Oh. Kalias grew to be a formidable Olympic champion, and from then his victories became legendary. All in Olympia who knew him loved him. None would have suspected he'd tamper with the Olympic results. No one but the cult. This declaration hereby recognizes these great champions as true servants of the gods in Olympia. A Pinetos, horsemaster, racing in the name of Poseidon. Kalias, master grappler, fighting in the name of Cosmos. Hippocratides. Hippocrates, there we go, got it that, got it that time. Master of Javelins, throwing in the name of Hermes. Hermes. I can't talk, I'm tired, sorry. <laughs> I haven't done the war in Beatia yet. I haven't done that quest line, the one that um, Archidamos sent me to do. I haven't done that yet. And the Olympics is what Pausanias sent me to do. And there's a cultist involved, the last cultist in the branch, besides the king himself. So, in Archidamos' quest line that I haven't done yet, I'm assuming we won't meet any more cultists. And I, I've been thinking this whole time, like, Testicles was such an idiot. <laughs> he was so incompetent, like, no way he would have won the Olympics with or without my help. Like, that's how hopeless he was. And that is what Pausanias wanted me to do. To ensure Sparta wins the Olympics. Which is weird, because Archidamos sent me into a freaking war. You'd think that that's a place someone would send me if they wanted me to die. You know? And this person's just like, ah, mess with the Olympics. Because, like, especially in this, in this day and age, it's easy to cast the traditionalist as the bad guy. You know? So, like, they would want me to lean towards Archidamos, right? And if the ghost is who I think she is, it would make more sense for Pausanias to be the sage, not Archidamos. So, yeah. Mm hmm. I can't track him, though, so I don't really know where he is. I mean, he was in the Pancratian just now. So I guess I'm just. I'm finding out who poisoned Alcibiades and why. Why would they. Alcibiades, his charm, known to get him in an ample amount of trouble, was poisoned at a party celebrating the games. Cassandra went in search of the culprit to find a way to save her friend. Can I go for him? Also, what's your level, sir? You're 49? I'm what, 51? Yeah. Oh, and I have a skill point. I kind of want to go for him. I know it's not technically story, but I want to go for him. However, my friend is poisoned, and if this is one of those instances where if I don't go do immediately something, then something will go wrong. Like with Hippocrates. Hippocrates, that's what it is. <laughs> so maybe that's- if I don't go do this right now, maybe I'll take too long and Alcibiades will die. I don't know. This was definitely poison, and Alcibiades wasn't the only victim. Oh my god. Christ almighty! This is some freaking Abu Nakud crap! Except minus the awesome wine fountain. <laughs> ah, the truce is fragile enough. Just going around looting all the dead bodies. <laughs> I am a Mistios after all. Wait, how do I get in there now? Uh, here we go. Okay, the kitchens are an absolute mess. The 
This food smells strange, but it's not rotten. Boxglove. Belladonna. This proves it. Poison. It must have been added to the food and wine. Aconite. Hard to detect unless you know what you're looking for. And then what does Arno say? He says, um, like, popular amongst Templars, eh? With anyone who wants to get away with murder. But yes. Oh, supply list for the celebration. And the merchant's name. Time to pay this Priam a visit. Priam, okay. Uh, I think it's time to go say hello before my friend dies of poison. I need to find the antidote. I don't need to know how the poison is made. I need to know how to counteract its effects. Is that the opposite? Thankfully, he's like right here. Unless he's inside. Shit. Let's go this way. Ugh. Pardon me, sir. Now. Oh, shit. We're going to have a conversation. Please. Please. I, I was just doing what I was told. Wow, he knows why I'm here already. Mmm. I don't want to do the killing one. One of the few times I've actually selected. An option with the red next to it hasn't worked out well for me. <laughs> Help me and I'll spare you, or I'm your boss now. Sure, I'll do this one. I'm not after you. I'm after whoever wanted this done. I don't know. I never saw him. I just thought he wanted to fix a race, but then I saw what started happening and I knew they'd been poisoned. My friend, Algibiadis, I need to save him. You'll likely find the antidote up at Fort Koroibos. Thank you. I don't need to kill you. Whoever did this will pay. Go, and don't let me see your face again. Yes, thank you. Okay. Whoa there! Okay then, excuse me, I don't have time for your fucking shit. Leave me be! Come on, man. Wait, what? There's somebody there. What is going on here? Oh, he's here. Okay. Here. I have the antidote. Oh, well, that was that was quick. Yeah. <laughs> Take your time. You're not dying. <laughs> Hurry up and drink the fucking oh. thing. More wine, please, to wash away the taste. A treatment worthy of Hippocrates. I can already feel my stamina return. Oh, and he's back. <laughs> Great. <clears throat> Didn't you have one last fight in the Pancration? I did. Let's go. But, okay. My friend is saved now. I don't know if I decided to do something else first if he would have died. I hope not. <laughs> but, okay, Pankratian. Talk to Pius. Okay, that guy again. I kind of want to go for Kalias first. Can I do that? Will it let me? Before the fight, can I kill him? He's tampering with the Olympic results and I'm supposed to win. Chances are he's not tampering it in my favor. You're a dead man walking, bro. I'm coming for you. Okay, I'm gonna do it right now. Uh, well, that's the that's the quest. Okay, I don't want to do that. I'm gonna do this first. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna go for Kalias. Let's do it. Have an escort? No, he's just out here all by himself. What a dumbass idiot. Does he not know who I am? <laughs> Stabby! Run the ass! Wow, I almost killed him. Whoa, hey. Oh, God! 
You are an angry man! I did not have to waste that. Guess I just wanted to give him an epic end, I suppose. Alright, that was way easier than I was expecting. Mmm! The odds are never in your favor. Oh, I got the sage letter. Okay, how do I drop bodies again? It's not circle. I mean... I know how to throw them. How do I put them down? Uh, that'll do. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna read that letter now. Afraid to look weak within the cult. Hmm. Okay, wait. Red blood, the king has sent Brasidas to Corinthia. He has been a thorn in our side long enough. Send him back to Sparta on his shield. The true blood runs red. Text message from who? Megan! It's my younger sister who just graduated from Georgetown last weekend. The true blood runs red. P. P! It's Pausanias! I told you it's Pausanias! Oh, he's afraid to look weak because Archidamos is the greater fighter. And that's how they're settling their disagreements politically is by, you know, sparring. Also, he's kind of the outsider in Sparta. Sparta is a very traditional, um, it's not a country, it's a city, right? Like, it's a very traditional place in Greece, and to have a more progressive leader, people don't really respect him or take him as seriously as they do Archidamos, especially because they respect a better fighter than a better mind, so yeah, it's him. Okay, this is the letter to Kalias. Red blood. The Olympic truce is hanging by a thread in these tormented times. We need to sever that thread. Now is the time to appear strong. Even within our own ranks, only strength commands fear. And only fear brings respect. I'm giving you this opportunity. Don't make me look weak for trusting you. The true blood runs red. What other clue? See, the thing is, there's a clue missing to figure out who the sage is. I've killed all of his underlings in the Peloponnesian League, and I'm still missing one clue. One, two, three, four. What's the final clue, and how do I find it? Okay, I'm back. Now I'm gonna have to fight Dollop and Daisy, whatever the frick his name was. Shut up! I've heard you say this like three times already. <laughs> Sorry, I had to text my sister back. Your next opponent is Dorios. That's right. Claims to be descended from Heracles himself. Of course he does. <laughs> um, here, one second. I, I have to text my sister back. Okay, I can send her the rest later. I, they're, they're I'm ready. You ever faced an Olympic champion before? No, but I've gotten this far. Well, you don't look the part. You're not even oil for Zeus's sake. Looks can be deceiving. Also, oil makes my weapons slip out of my fingers. I do have oil. <laughs> I went through all that trouble to make the oil to give it to Testicles, and he didn't even use it before he turned into shark bait. Ooh ha ha. So, yeah. Sure, I'll use it. I do have some oil. It could come in handy. And it smelled good. It did smell good. I'll use it. Cinnamon always smells good. I will respect the traditions of the Olympics. Olympic Games. Whatever. <laughs> I'm a little loopy still. Mmm. Well, that music got real real quick. Oh, I'm all shiny! You smell better than last time. Fuck off! Let's get this over with. For Ira. We've seen our esteemed newcomer rise quickly to become a contender. <laughs> Your tunic but glitched out of it there. how she does against the reigning champion, Zoria. Oh my god, he's large. Is anyone gonna address that this well-loved Kalias is not here to oversee the proceedings? Oh, I see Alkibiades has recovered. <laughs> recovered quickly. I am dead. Ooh. Wait, are you kidding me? Is this squash you like a bug? That's fucking ow! I already almost have you dead, dude. Woo! Oh, sweet dog, bro. You have to try harder if you want to live. 
Oh god, he swings faster than me. Okay, you know what? Why won't you die? Because I was um Oh ouch, god he swings fast. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. It won't last much longer. <laughs> that was so easy! I was expecting that to be hard! <laughs> it's like Luke at the end of episode 8. Big funny! <laughs> Nike! Nike! Just do it, bitches! Okay, sorry. Hashtag not spot. That was so easy. I guess I'm technically not supposed to be this highly leveled yet, but I played the shit out of the open world of this game uh, while I was still trying to finish up Curse of the Pharaohs for you guys. So, yeah. <laughs> that was really easy. Is that it? Am I done? Or do I have more Olympics to do? I probably have more the Olympics gods to do. The gods have looked kindly on these, our champions! I'm the only one here. But there can only be one winner! Me? Sparta! Sparta! My people needs me! <laughs> Eternal glory for you, testicles, for you. Aww. I did it! I won the Olympics! That was easy. I was expecting it to be hard because, you know, it's the Olympics. <laughs> but it was it was really easy. <laughs> I hope Pausinius is okay with that. He's like, you need to protect this champion and make sure he wins at all costs. Oh, by the way, he's dead. Hey, going for gold. <laughs> Nah, <laughs> I can have Olympic athletes, male and female, on my ship. I like my, uh, their assassins. They're female assassins, right? Yeah. Okay, so, is that the Olympic quest line just done? I thought that was gonna be a lot harder, and not as ridiculous. Oh, damn, I need 11 more fragments. Does that mean I have to kill the rest of the cultists? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11... So I need to kill all but Demos and the Ghost to upgrade my spear one last time. Jesus, okay. I got a ways to go before I can upgrade my spear again. With the King's Edict in one hand and her spear in the other, Cassandra was tasked with conquering Beatia for Sparta, making sure the Athenians didn't get there first. Oh, whoops. And I saved that for last. Okay, well, I guess I'm doing that now. The Olympic quest line is done. That was really easy. Um, okay, I need to go to Beatia, which is like up here. Oh no, that's... Evoia, whatever. Beatia, here it is. He's down here. Okay, so I will fast travel here. And I'm assuming this is gonna be another one of those, like, battleground things. Um, and I saved it for last, so the Athenians probably got there first. Sorry, but I really wanted to do the Olympic quest line, and I'm glad I did. Oh my god, that was so funny. Man, it takes forever to load into the game when you first pull it up. And then fast travel takes, like, almost no time. I've seen those videos, by the way, of uh, PS5, like, comparing loading times on, like, a, is it a standard PS4 or is it a Pro? And then, because I have a Pro. And then, uh, you know, comparing the loading times of one game there and then the same game on PS5. Crazy. That blew my mind when I watched that. So, I'm so excited for the PS5. Will I be getting a PS5? Probably not right when it comes out. Just saying. But, yes. And I don't know if I'll be getting whatever the next Xbox console is. I don't know if I'll be getting it because I, three, the Xbox 360 PS3 era, I loved the Xbox 360. PS3 was not my thing. The only reason I got a PS3 was so I could play Uncharted. And then I also found, I found Shadow of the Colossus Journey and The Last of Us. But the only reason I got a PS3 at the time was because I wanted to play Uncharted because I was a huge fan of Tomb Raider. But then once I played those, I never touched my PS3 again. It was all Xbox 360. I had the highest gamer score there. Um, I had the biggest friends list there. I just liked the overall setup of the Xbox 360, like the dashboard and stuff in comparison to the PS3. I just liked it better in almost every, every way. Except for the fact that at the time, PlayStation Network was free and Xbox Live was not. This generation, I got an Xbox One first, played a lot of games on the Xbox One, and then I got a PS4 so I could play games with Sarah after she moved away, because she was she grew up with PlayStation, I grew up with Nintendo. But I got a PS4 so we could play together, and that opened the door to so many exclusives. I got to finish off Uncharted, 
on the PS4, I got Detroit. I mean, duh. Um, the Last of Us Remastered, which technically is a PS3 title. Um, the Last Guardian. I finally got to play that. Uh, Horizon Zero Dawn. What does Xbox One have in terms of exclusives that can measure up to that? They don't really have any. Sea of Thieves, I've heard, is great now. Sea of Thieves, I've heard, is an amazing game now, but... Okay, one game. Scalebound looked good, but that's cancelled. At least half of my top ten games of all time are PlayStation exclusives. Pretty much the only thing I use my Xbox for now is... Hulu and YouTube. And HBO. You know, when I watch Game of Thrones, I had HBO now. So, yeah, like, that's pretty much it. <laughs> so, when it comes to the next console generation... I'm looking at my pro. That's why I keep looking over here, by the way. <laughs> my, my Jedi is its name. Jedi is sitting right over there. Um, because the first game I got for PlayStation 4 slash pro was Star Wars Battlefront. So its name is Jedi. PlayStation 5 won't be a day one buy for me either. I'll wait for the price to go down a little. Um, especially since PS5 is going to be backward compatible. You're going to be able to play PS4 games on the PS5. As well as... Oh, um, look who's back. <laughs> hey, Icarus. Uh, it's also going to be compatible for PlayStation VR. I won't have to get a whole new VR headset to, to keep playing VR when I get the 5. So that's awesome. So there's really no rush. I don't need it immediately. So we're sticking with the Pro for a while when the PS5 comes out. But will I be getting a PS5? TLDR? <laughs> Absolutely. I guess TLDL? Too long, didn't listen? <laughs> that was quite a rant. <laughs> but anyway, yeah. <sighs> I haven't really talked about that yet, so. You. Oh, hi, Stentor. Santa? Whoa! <sighs> Fucking uncalled for. I'm assuming that's for the wolf. Right, that's for my father. I'm here to help, you idiot. Not after Megaris. Not after what you did. I didn't kill him. King Archigamos of Sparta sent me to aid you. In securing the region. Right, I, I, I lost him his father, whether this I exiled him or killed him or what. He put his faith in a fucking mercenary. Hey, didn't you? I mean, I didn't the kill him. The gods are punishing me with your presence. If I was your punishment, you'd already be dead. Why have the king sent you? To steal your glory, I've missed my brother. I've come to help Sparta. Well, definitely not the top one. <laughs> so, wait, what's he mad about? I exiled his father, right? I went to confront him, or to talk to him, and then he disappeared. So, is he just assuming I killed him? Because I didn't. I really want to see what happens if I select this. I'll do that. I missed my new brother so much that when Archidamo sent me here, I jumped at the chance. Malaka. The wolf would have ended the war if it weren't for you. Your help will bring nothing I figured he wouldn't, he wouldn't buy into it. <laughs> I wanted to suck up a bit. You should be glad I'm here. What's the I'm here on business. What's going on? Everything is fine. The VOD and rebels are a problem, but nothing we can't handle. It's like Bartolomeo, Delviana. They seem to be getting closer. The situation is under control. <laughs> close the gates! Close the gates! Bennett, so maybe I could use a little help. <laughs> What is the Spartan army doing in Viotia? We siege Athens, but Cleon took power and pushed us out. Ah, that guy. He's got to be a sage, right? The wolf was gone. I was needed. I couldn't abandon my men. That's my Google clock. I still don't know if you guys can hear it in the background, but it's definitely going off right now because it's 10 a.m. You should thank the gods that I've come to help you. The only reason you're still alive is that writ you carry. You're not an ally. Just a weapon. Well, ouch. Then put me to work. You're not up to the challenge. Fuck right. off! There are four Viodian champions fighting for the Athenians. Aristeos, Vianira, Nesea, and Veragon. Think you can kill them? Dragon! I'd like to see you try. I told you we could work this out. Where are my dragons? This guy hates me enough. All right, then. I'll find these champions and put an end to them. I doubt it will be as easy as you think. But I'm relieved to see you can follow orders. Did I not follow orders in Megaris? I did! And you rewarded me with being able to talk to my own fucking father! Where will I find them? 
Where will I find these mighty Viotians? I only know of two. There are reports of Aristeos occupying the military fort of Gla. Nesea was last Gla. seen in the forest east of Thebes. <laughs> Gla. Our, uh, our hotel in Arlington, Virginia, uh, when I went to D.C. just this past weekend, um, that was on South Glebe Street. It's Best Western... I think it's called Best Western Pentagon. Uh, on South Glebe Street. Don't stay there. Don't. Our shower head leaked and there was water all over the bathroom all the time. The, like, wallpaper was peeling. Um, if you flipped the light switch on the wall by the door, it shut off all the power in the room, all the outlets, everything. So, like, you couldn't charge your stuff overnight. It sucked. I mean, the beds were very comfy and the pillows were heavenly. I love hotel pillows, always. But don't stay there. Pro tip. I thought the Viotians hated everyone. Why are they working with Athens? They see both Sparta and Athens as enemies. But Athens got here first. And they agreed to a temporary alliance. I took too long, didn't I? Whoops. Yeah, and speaking of Pentagon, um, I w it was my very first time taking a metro ever, like in any city. <laughs> my sister, we get off the bus, uh, the, the shuttle, whatever, and we're like walking down into the station below the Pentagon, which was creepy. And she was like, this is probably the closest you're ever going to get to the Pentagon. And we were right next to it. It was kind of cool. I mean, it's a public station, so it's not like it was special or anything. But for me, I was like, ooh, Pentagon. <laughs> and then we went under it. Like, it was like some secret bunker. What's it was, so great was kind of crazy. Champions. They're just four people against There's pictures the on Instagram. Military. My Instagram. Sparta Go check them out. Army, and Viodia has its legends. And they're a symbol of what this place used to be. What did it used to be, sir? The sooner I get this done, the sooner we take Viotia for Sparta. I was not expecting him to be that angry. I feel like I got him and uh, Brasidas backwards. Like, I was expecting Brasidas to be so mad at me, and he kind of, he told me off a bit, but that was it. And now I'm just like, Stentor probably won't like me, but whatever, and then he punched me in the damn face. Oh, find an assassinate. I already killed two of them? How is that possible? Were they part of quests I did and I just didn't know? Which ones are left? Dracon and Aristeos are still up. Island at the center of Lake Kopais. Okay, Kopais. Okay, so I got one in here. Yeah. Oh god, he's in the fucking fort, isn't he? And where's Thebes? That is not Thebes. Where is Thebes? Is this Thebes? Okay, so I've got one in here and one there. Okay, so I'll go for the guy in Thebes first because he's closer. Oh. 